he's about even on supply and honestly a lot of the supply is in drones and he's done a very very good job with a lot of these engagements between Psystorm things like that but oh this is a lot of Ultralisks out in the field they're pretty decently upgraded they don't have the Carapace upgrade or whatnot yet and they're going up um, Dragoons actually do pretty well against Ultralisks but there's a lot of Zerglings to support this um, and, uh, and these Dragoons are not very highly upgraded uh, Zealots coming in to kind of support and uh, the Ultralisks continuing to get annihilated there's no okay it looks like the level 3 Carapace kicking in there's not any Dark Swarm to really support this as well kind of curious about this uh, Ultralisk fetish like game without the, the storm support. I guess it does kind of inflate your supply. Uh, I mean, if you have the resources, mine, the big Zerglings might as well spend it there. Um, now that armory is starting to press through it rather easily because a lot of Zergling support absorbing the damage you put. Just chew right through it. Um, and that level 3 Carapace really paying off. Still waiting for that additional Carapace upgrade on the Ultralisk Cavern. Doesn't look like it's actually coming, but I, I think Ultralisks have speed here. Now working in for a drop. Denzak, unfortunately, um, well, never mind. He has a lot of minerals, so he can build a lot of Zealots, uh, but l very low on gas. Has ex secured the 6 o'clock, but he's not mining out of it yet. Looks like some drones are sweeping right back after they wiped out that army to take uh, those expansions again. 12 o'clock base, still not rolling. One Reaver still somehow in this shuttle, and I'm curious how many kills it must have. I think... I gotta assume I missed some kills here at that natural. Ex Never mind. There's the transfer, um, and they're gonna be pretty vulnerable with that shuttle moving around. So that shuttle doesn't look like it was able to track them down. A bunch of sunken colonies providing some latent defense uh, against the rest of this, and that's uh, yeah, um, that works out pretty well actually. And I, I, I almost wish the queens would do that sometimes. Um, just put down a sunken colony too when going up against Corsair Reaver. Because once you have two sunken colonies back there, what are they gonna do? I mean, they're gonna plant. They've got a actually forcibly micro um, those reavers it's not going to work out for them these these ultralisks now being supplemented with some hydralisks that are fully upgraded as well more ultralisks pouring out and uh, this is this is going to be kind of crazy because i honestly the zealots um outnumbered now outmanned they're still stalwart and going to engage though you can see how quickly they're melting with these really highly upgraded ultralisks just outloading a lot of damage not enough Dragoons to really micro against this and push this back. You really need kind of a critical mass of Dragoons to make it work. And then uh, you worry about Swarm, which I felt like Denzak had a little bit earlier going up against DJ Elliot. I mean, it was like five Ultralisks versus, what, 15 Dragoons? Maybe it was a little, my memory may be hazy. But uh, additional weapons upgrades coming up, but the Ultralisks already sitting there knocking on the doorstep. Um, a probe just wandering out. I'm kind of wondering what happened to that shuttle in the meantime, if it's just hanging out at the 6 o'clock. I don't know. Um, but a bunch of Ultralisks diving in, doing a ton of damage. Um, and yeah, they can just eat that size storm like nom nom nom. Um, kill the High Templar. Natural expansion once again getting completely bowled over. Den uh, Denzak's supply absolutely plummeting. DJ Lea able to maintain it. It looks like he is going to be able to win this match. To put it to a fifth and final set. I'm actually curious what map it's going to be on. Um, Denzak, what, wow, that's actually pretty... Wow, and taking the natural expansion there. Kind of... Um, kind of spicy. Let's see if he decides to stick it out. Uh, still could pretty uh, put up a pretty big fight. I mean, he's got a lot of minerals. He needs to plant a lot of gateways. And right now, it looks like he's producing... He's trying to produce Dragoons to deal with these Ultralisks, but uh, it's not happening. I'm kind of curious what that A was about. Yeah, I think that was uh, anticipatory GG right there. and just mistyped. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Going to a fifth and final set. Great game between Dunzak and DJ Leia. Thanks for listening.